The higher education social innovation initiative is really timely and relevant. As a leader in higher education, I've been increasingly frustrated with this reality, which is universities working independently, largely quietly in their own respective silos, uh, working on really important and innovative things, but not necessarily working together and rowing toward a common shared North Star. So I believe in this initiative because first and foremost, it is bringing together university leaders and other leaders from around the globe who are not only serious about change and innovation, but acknowledge that if we work better together, we can achieve better impact across the globe. There's a lot of benefit uh, in integrating inner well-being work with social change work. I would say that the first real benefit is acknowledging that we bring our own humanity to the work of change and our own humanity is bodied. Uh, we need to really reclaim the body in education, in higher education in particular, we've lost her somewhere along the way. And in order to truly be innovative, we have to pay attention to what's going on inside of our bodies. Uh, because we have bodies, we have brains and minds, and they all equally need to be tethered together and brought together online to really create the kinds of conditions that will allow us to flourish in the midst of our change work. So. Inner well-being uh, is essential and integral to any notion of sustained change-making and innovation in the world. And in particular, when brought online in university settings, I think we will achieve something far beyond our wildest imaginations.